Someone has built these very complex numerical models that say, if you tell me where we are right now, I will tell you where we're going to be in an hour, in two days, in seven days. Three days before a hurricane hit the United States, our average error was 400 miles. So, you know, if we thought it was going to hit in Mississippi, it might hit in South Texas, it might hit Florida. When I started working in 1988, uh, the Storm Prediction Center gave us two-day outlooks. You know, today and tomorrow. And tomorrow's was kind of iffy. As computers got faster, we were able to convert that into better weather forecasts. That's all because of pouring all this data into models, running these very high resolution models, and the output having some skill. It's all based on computing power. Because of that, we can start days ahead going, today is Monday, Thursday is going to be a bad day. You know, People can prepare. I'll go shopping on Wednesday. We can issue a warning and in less than 20 seconds it's on the radio, it's triggering the emergency alert system, people are getting it on their cell phones. That difference saves lives, saves money. And it's all because computing power can support much more rapid assimilation of information and dissemination of information.